Hey, good afternoon, good morning. For those who don't know me, I am Brandia, and I'm taking over Sandy's Snapchat story. So I wanted to give you guys some exercise tips, some more physiological reasons for why you should exercise, along with an exercise challenge this week. I'll introduce myself really quickly. These exercises will be on my YouTube, which is at the link below, and my Snapchat is also at the link below as well. Let's get right into it. So a lot of the physiological benefits from staying active are to increase your mitochondrial density. What the heck are mitochondria? <laughs> mitochondria are the powerhouses of our cells. They produce ATP, which is energy, which we all want more energy, right? So that being said, what leads to increased mitochondrial density? Aerobic exercise. That's not to say that resistance training or body weight training isn't good. So resistance training is good because it provides that additional stimulus that your body needs to increase your fitness level and your overall health. Ladies, I know what you're thinking. Lifting weights is going to make you look bulky. So all those fad workouts that are out there are geared towards making us not lift weights. Women, we don't produce enough testosterone to have that bulky appearance that men do. But we can achieve a fit, toned physique by lifting weights exercise or if you have any questions feel free to reach out to me on my youtube or on my snapchat which i will put at the end of the story thank you so with the modified push-up i'm going to have my knees bent and gently lower my chest down so one modification i would make is performing a modified push-up or plank on the wall if you have knee hip or back issues Okay, this next one is a deadlift. You're gently going to hinge at the hips, thinking that you have a string pulling you down. So after you hinge at the hips, you're going to come up, squeezing your glutes, your back, along with your core. For this next exercise, exercise three, I chose monster walks. Now, they are a more advanced form of a squat, but they are going to focus on targeting your hip stable. For this next exercise, I chose monster walk. So you're gently going to start in a squat position like you're sitting down and open. From the side, they look like this. Open, close. So you're hinging at the waist, but staying. Final exercise. I didn't want to take that much of your time with the challenge because I wanted you to be able to focus on total body in a short amount of time. Four is a squat plus a kick. So it's kind of tough, but I wanted to challenge your balance while working on your core functionally. So with this one, you're going to gently squat back, similar to monster walks, and push up. So it challenges your balance. You're also going to do squat and kick out to the back for additional challenge to train the... It's a five-day challenge, four exercises, and they shouldn't take too much of your time. So I'm going to put a snap of my handles and of the exercises below. Here are all my handles and feel free to reach me and I look forward to working with you all soon and in the future. Have a good day. Thank you again Sandy for this opportunity. I look forward to working with everyone and again five-day challenge these four exercises. Feel free to reach out for any questions.